Hey guys, I've got another Exposed module to show you today. This one's called Status Bar Gestures. It's available in the Exposed installer and what this allows you to do is set gestures on your status bar for quick access to things like apps or shortcuts. You can see some in action right now, including swiping left and right and also pressing and holding. There are of course some others you can choose from, so yeah, let's check it out. So if we open up the module, it's very simple to use and well laid out. You can see each gesture has its own headline, for example, single tap and double tap, etc. So you have the choice between launch application or launch shortcut and launch shortcut gives you a ton of different options. You'll notice I have actions at the top of mine. These are actually Mardi actions, but if you have gravity box, you'll also have some similar options. You can choose things like kill an app, select pie controls and lots more. As I've mentioned, shortcuts give you a ton of choice. You can have quick access to your favorite book, direct dial someone, open your Dropbox folder. And of course, if you're a tasker user, you can have it run a task. So there's absolutely loads of actions you can actually set as a gesture. And of course, if you want quick access to an application like I showed in the introduction, you can just select launch app and pick any application installed on your device. As an example, we'll select BBC iPlayer for the single tap and you can see as I single tap the status bar, it's gonna go ahead and open the BBC iPlayer. If I swipe to the right, it opens Twitter, swipe to the left, it opens Spotify. And if I press and hold, it's gonna go ahead and open my alternative Twitch application. Now this is only available when the status bar is actually there. So when you pull down your notification shade or your quick settings toggles, you won't be able to access the gestures. Diving back into the application here, we have a few options. You can disable haptic feedback. So when you touch the status bar, you don't get any vibration. And if you enable the advanced settings and have a ROM that supports Halo or an exposed module, you can have your app launch in the Halo window. Also, you get an option to customize the delay. So if you want the long press to be shorter, you can change it here. So yeah, there you go guys, let me know what you think. Peace out.